Aumuamua is the first interstellar object detected passing through the solar system. Formally designated 1I, 2017 U1, Oumuamua was discovered by Robert Warrick using the Pan-STARRS telescope at Haleakala Observatory, Hawaii, on 19 October 2017, approximately 40 days after it passed its closest point to the Sun on 9 September. When it was first observed, it was about 33 million kilometers from Earth, and already heading away from the Sun. Oumuamua is a small object estimated to be between 100 and 1,000 meters long, with its width and thickness both estimated to range between 35 and 167 meters. It has a red color, similar to objects in the outer solar system. Despite its close approach to the Sun, Oumuamua showed no signs of having a coma. It has exhibited non-gravitational acceleration, potentially due to outgassing or a push from solar radiation pressure. The object could be a remnant of a disintegrated rogue comet, according to astronomer Zdenek Sekonina. The object has a rotation rate similar to the average spin rate seen in solar system asteroids, but many valid models permit it to be more elongated than all but a few other natural bodies. While an unconsolidated object would require it to be of a density similar to rocky asteroids, a small amount of internal strength similar to icy comets would allow a relatively low density. Oumuamua's light curve, assuming little systematic error, presents its motion as tumbling, rather than spinning, and moving sufficiently fast relative to the Sun that it is likely of an extrasolar origin. Extrapolated and without further deceleration, Oumuamua's path cannot be captured into a solar orbit, so it would eventually leave the solar system and continue into interstellar space. Oumuamua's planetary system of origin and the age of its excursion are unknown. By July 2019, most astronomers concluded that Oumuamua is a natural object. A small number of astronomers suggested that Oumuamua could be a product of alien technology, but evidence in support of this hypothesis is severely lacking. In March 2021, scientists presented a theory based on nitrogen ice that Oumuamua may be a piece of an exoplanet similar to Pluto, from beyond our solar system. In January 2022, researchers proposed Project Lyra, which presented the notion that a spacecraft launched from Earth could catch up to Oumuamua in 26 years for further close-up studies. As the first known object of its type, Oumuamua presented a unique case for the International Astronomical Union, which assigns designations for astronomical objects. Originally classified as Comet C, 2017 U1, it was later reclassified as Asteroid A, 2017 U1 due to the absence of a coma. Once it was unambiguously identified as coming from outside the solar system, a new designation was created, I, for interstellar object. As the first object so identified, Oumuamua was designated 1I, with rules for the eligibility of objects for I numbers and the names to be assigned to these interstellar objects yet to be codified. The object may be called 1I, 1I, 2017 U1, 1I, Oumuamua, or 1I, 2017 U1. The name comes from Hawaiian Oumuamua, scout, and reflects the way the object is like a scout or messenger sent from the distant past to reach out to humanity. It roughly translates to, first distant messenger. The first character diacritic is a Hawaiian okina, not an apostrophe, and is pronounced as a glottal stop. The Pan-STARRS team chose the name in consultation with Kiyu Kimura and Larry Kimura of the University of Hawaii at Hilo. Before the official name was decided, Rama was suggested, the name given to an alien spacecraft discovered under similar circumstances in the 1973 science fiction novel Rendezvous with Rama by Arthur C. Clarke. Observations and conclusions concerning the trajectory of Oumuamua were primarily obtained with data from the Pan-STARRS-1 telescope, part of the SpaceGuard survey, and the Canada-France-Hawaii telescope, and its composition and shape from the Very Large Telescope and the Gemini South Telescope in Chile, as well as the Keck-2 telescope in Hawaii. These were collected by Karen J. Meech, Robert Warrick and their colleagues and published in Nature on 20 November 2017. The space-based telescopes Hubble and Spitzer joined in the observations. It was not seen in stereo HI-1A observations near its perihelion on 9 September 2017, limiting its brightness to approximately 13.5 mag. By the end of October, Oumuamua had already faded to about apparent magnitude 23, and in mid-December 2017, it was too faint and fast-moving to be studied by even the largest ground-based telescopes. Oumuamua was compared to the fictional alien spacecraft Rama due to its interstellar origin. Adding to the coincidence, both the real and the fictional objects are unusually elongated. Oumuamua has a reddish hue and unsteady brightness, which are typical of asteroids. The SETI Institute's radio telescope, the Allen Telescope Array, examined Oumuamua, but detected no unusual radio emissions. 
More detailed observations, using the Breakthrough Listen hardware and the Green Bank Telescope, were performed. The data were searched for narrowband signals and none were found. Given the close proximity to this interstellar object, limits were placed to putative transmitters with the extremely low effective isotropically radiated power of 0.08 watts. Aumuamua appears to have come from roughly the direction of Vega in the constellation Lyra. The incoming direction of motion of Oumuamua is 6 degrees from the solar apex, which is the most likely direction from which objects coming from outside the solar system should approach. On the 26th of October, two recovery observations from the Catalina Sky Survey were found dated 14 and the 17th of October. The two-week observation arc had verified a strongly hyperbolic trajectory. It has a hyperbolic excess velocity of 26.33 km per second, its speed relative to the Sun when in interstellar space. By mid-November, astronomers were certain that it was an interstellar object. Based on observations spanning 80 days, Oumuamua's orbital eccentricity is 1.20, the highest ever observed until 2i, Borisov was discovered in August 2019. An eccentricity exceeding 1.0 means an object exceeds the Sun's escape velocity, is not bound to the solar system and may escape to interstellar space. While an eccentricity slightly above 1.0 can be obtained by encounters with planets, as happened with the previous record holder, c. 1980E1, Oumuamua's eccentricity is so high that it could not have been obtained through an encounter with any of the planets in the solar system.